Hey everyone, Jack Tagger 93 here, back in with some more Quake. So today we're going to play a random Quake map right off of Quadicted. This is the webpage I use to get my Quake maps. Um, you can either download it directly from here, like I'll be doing, or you can use the Quake Injector tool, which is pretty handy as well, but some of the maps need a very, very specific installation uh, procedure to get them working, but that would be in the readme files. Anyway, so today I'm going to pick a random map. Hopefully it's one that uh, I can get through on skill 3. Because I'm on a kind of a losing streak. The last two maps we did, I wasn't able to make it through. Uh, Fairweather's map uh, last week actually kicked my butt. That Vor ambush at the that got me. That uh, that still gives me nightmares. But anyway, I'm gonna click play a random map, and I'll download it, provided it's not something I already uploaded and played on the uh, channel, and provided it's not a deathmatch only map. You know, it has to be single player, and finished as well. So let's see what we get. Uh, okay, um, this looks interesting. Okay, well, it was made in 1999, October 1999, awesome, it's almost October, it's almost spooky season. Um, it's an arena, monster waves, I'm assuming there might be an exit, we'll, we'll find out. Looks like we got some custom texture work as well, so, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and download this one. Alright, let's open her up. Okay, no readme file, just our map file here. So, what you want to do, and if you already know this, you can just skip ahead to the gameplay. I'll have a link in the description where the gameplay starts. But, um, you have your Quake shortcut. By the way, these are all different, I don't know why I have it with a T there, but that's the Arcane Dimensions Quake. Quake 4 shortcut, I know, but I, I kind of like the single player. Quake Champions, which is actually pretty fun. Uh, the one thing holding it back really is Bethesda themselves, I think. Quake 2, which I love playing this single player for nostalgia. Uh, Quake 1 installation. Quake Injector, which I keep separate from my Quake installation. Because sometimes uh, Quake Injector will download other files that will conflict with your normal Quake files. And this says Quake Spasm, but um, that's actually for Copper Quake. So anyway, uh, you're going to open up your file location. Like so. And you go to your id1 folder, maps, and this is called j1bsp. We're going to put that right in there. All right. Go back out. And we're going to run our quake. All right. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so from here, you can do it. Um, maps. If you don't remember what the map was called, you just type in maps in the console command, just like that. It's J1. Map. J1. Alright. We want this on skill 3. And let's restart it, just to make sure. The battle commence. Yep. Coca-Cola. Alright. Looks like we got sponsors. We got sponsors here. We got Wheaties. This was made, like, in, um, Jolt Cola. Nice. If this was made like now, I wonder what the sponsor would be. Probably like, um, what's it called? G, G Dubs, G, something like that. And then G Fuel as well. 49, 48 enemies, where are they at? Escape from LA, nice. Oh, doggos. I'm wondering if I want to conserve ammo. Well, I got plenty of shells right now. More to go. Yep. Save that last shell. Oh shoot, I forgot. Um, you know what? It's only 48 enemies. I'm going to give myself no lives and no saves to try to get through this one. That's right. This is my first time playing this map. I'm not, I'm going to go until I die. Because it seems like a very short map. Ooh, we got some spooky stuff happening here, people. These first aid boxes are just kind of floating. We need an exorcist. Ooh. Any secrets? No. Roar. What's roar? Fiends? Fiends? Fiends roar. Where, where's my fiend? Let's go. What? Some weird things going on with the lighting and shadows, actually. 
Oh, knights. Okay. Alright, not a big deal. Got plenty of room to move, too, so this is sh this should not be too bad. New, 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 new. Sequence completed, but we got one more left. I might just keep him up for now. I just have a bullet shield if I need it. Roar. Okay. So I guess that means another wave coming. What's next? Alright, we got enforcers. Ow. Alright. Gotta remember those uh, first aid kits are there when we need them. Alright, I'll just kill you now. I get the feeling this map is gonna like screw me over though. It's oh, we got spawns. We got spawns, people. We got spawns. Woo. Okay. Yeah, those are always uh, always a lot of fun to try and deal with. So grenade launcher. I'm guessing zombies would be next. That would make sense given that we were just given the grenade launcher. I'm always a sucker for that classic blue skybox, by the way. I always love it. Alright. New track. Yeah. There we go. Mm, feeling it. Oh, ogres. Okay. Alright. Odd that they would start that far back. Because they're going to have a hard time reaching us with their grenades like that. I'm just tenderizing them with my buckshot right now. Alright, and finally an enemy that drops ammo. Grenades mainly, so that's good. Checking if there's any more new guns. Rocket launcher, alright. Looks like we're almost done with this map, too. Um, I'm a little worried still because we have not been given armor. So, hits hurt right now. Getting shot hurts a lot. Alright, what do we got? Looks like Death Knights. Alright, I probably would want to use... Yeah, rocket launcher to take him out quickly. Looks like there might be a Thunderbolt weapon back there, too, which is lovely. Alright. Let's grab a first aid kit. Why not? We're drowning in health right now. Which is nice. Yeah, Thunderbolt. But, uh, I just wish we had, um, armor. Um, this map, by the way, is not really using enemies to their strengths. Like, ogres are at their, you know, they're at their most deadly when they're when there's a height uh, differential going on, when you have them on a platform um, just above you, and they're raining grenades down. This area, too, would be great for um, some scrag fighting, too. Have some scrags uh, trying to harass me from uh, different levels while having, say, fiends try to charge at us. Uh, that would be interesting. Um, this would be really nasty, too, to have vores uh, spawn in. You know, vores, those things on uh, four legs that shoot those uh, balls that home in on you. Uh, this area would be very nasty if they had surprise vores popping in these corners here. But no, so far it's been very predictable. I'm waiting on a... Is that, are those spawns again? Oh no, they're fiends. Okay, they're just so far back. I'm out of uh, nails and shells there. I have uh, some rockets left and a 
Thunderbolt left. Now, we got one more enemy left. Oh, no, not. We got five more. Never mind. I thought it was just one. Never mind. I was going to say, if it was just one left, I thought it would be a Shambler. But yeah, no, this map is, um... So far... Yeah, it's, uh... I don't get it. You know what? I, no, I don't have the armor. If I had the armor, I would just rocket jump up there. I'm guessing that's probably the exit. Oh, Vores. Here we go. Here we go. Wait for the projectiles to hit something. Alright. Dead yet? I don't like how I'm running out of ammo right now. <laughs> Alright, nice. Come on, I need some ammo. Nothing. Oh, okay. This is br this is bad. All right, we got a shambler. Thankfully, he's our last enemy. We have some thunderbolt left, so this should be doable. Nice. All right. Huh, you know what? I kind of. I like maps like this. Um, they're kind of charming in a way. I just wish more was done um, with it. I did it on skill 3, but uh, I don't think the author paid much attention to difficulty at all. Um, why they kept insisting on having enemies spawn in from... or just come out of these closets on either side and just... that's kind of... You could have had it four different ways. Boop, 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 north, south, east, and west. And also have enemies teleport in, too. Like, when a new wave would come in, have some scrags pop up to uh, harass me a little more. So this one was a bit on the easy side, but it was a nice pick-me-up, actually, because I've been getting my ass kicked from um, newer maps. Uh, there is a new uh, map jam up, by the way. It's for the Copper Mod. I'm hoping to... Uh, time has been tough. I did just get a new job, and I'm ha very happy to get it, because uh, getting a job during these times is tough. Uh, but I'm really happy I got it, but my time has been um, uh, pretty uh, shrinking. Um, to get to this job, it's you know quite a commute, actually. It's about an hour uh, back and forward. Um, but uh, yeah, I would love to give it the same kind of treatment I did with the, my summer map jam, the Copper Tone map jam, where I did a tier list. I thought that was a really cool way to go about it, and I would love to do that. Um, there's also a new map up as well that uses the Quoth. Um, add-on, and I might give that one a shot, but, uh, yeah. There you have it. I uh, did this one without dying. Um, I would brag about it, but that, this map was kind of on the easy side, but, uh, eh, give it a shot. Link in the description, and I hope you enjoyed watching. This is Jagtagger93 signing out. I hope you all have a great weekend.